Okay, we're gonna just try and turn around real quick. I've got my light bulb limiter on. So we'll see what happens. That looks good. Nothing blew up. All right, so that, that's good. We will turn her off. Switch out the light bulb limiter and try it again. Actually, I should probably do this first. And that looks okay too. Just a quick inrush. All right, looks good. All right, so now what I'm gonna do is we're going to carefully turn on and we will see what we get. Oh wait, we have to switch quickly, sorry. I do wanna take this out of the light bulb limiter now. I'll get straight in down below. All right, here we go. Definitely have to let it come up to temperature a little bit. Six millivolts there. Oh, that doesn't make sense, 300 millivolts on that side. Oh, 220 volts there. Okay, so we're, we're uh, well, that might mean I'm not making a good connection. 7.7. And that's also about 7.7. All right, so I'll have to look up what a good bias point is, but that's good. So what I really should do, I guess, at this point, is plug your guitar in and see what it sounds like. So let me do that. Try input one. Got all the volumes down to nothing right now, so we won't hear anything. But oh, no noise. No output. All right. Well, we'll click a peek. See if we can figure out what's going on. Uh, it's very possible that I have. Um, oh, I got my wire cable around everywhere. I've got. Uh, some voltages that are out of whack, but let's look at our voltages on the rail. That's 426, 425, 4, 48, that's weird, 212, 381, 346, so it's like this again. 44 volts. That's weird. Got negative 46 volts on that. Everywhere else, it seems like I've got good power. Um, and nine. So yeah, those are there's a fairly well balanced. I think that seems a little low, but I'll worry about setting the bias later. I do seem to see something kind of weird where, in my first stage, I've got. 425 volts. My second stage, one of them I get 211 volts, but the other one I'm only getting, oh, oh, yeah, 30 volts. So something's a bit wrong with this guy. I don't know why. We'll have to look into that. Maybe I've got something uh, loose or wrong there. Okay. Huh. All right. Well, I'll take a look at that and see what I figure out. We'll get back to you for a troubleshot a little bit. All right, well, I figured it out. I just had mix up in my head the tip versus the sleeve. So here we go. You, you look at it. That's the drive channel. Together again, pretty happy. It's all done. Uh, I 
think the only thing I didn't do was the reverb, but I forgot about it, and then I put it all together, and the reverb, to me, sounds actually really good. So, anyway, there you have it. Thanks, guys. Keep your amp spies hot. Keep the tunes coming.